Welcome to my channel, my name is Benji Travis and today I'll be sharing my recipe for the sous vide egg bites. That's right, the same ones that you see at Starbucks. I'm sure if you're watching this video, you buy all the time. I love them, they're the perfect protein snack and you know what, I'm gonna show you how you can make it at home and before we get into the ingredients, Follow me on Instagram, my name is Benjamin TV. I'll put all the links down below where you can follow my journey as I cook for my family. I'll put all the links to everything I use in the info box area, but this is basically what's gonna sous vide your food. And it's just gonna take all your water and keep it at a constant temperature. And it's totally worth having, not just for sous vide egg bites, but for so many other sous vide recipes. So let's jump right into the ingredients. I've got about 12 eggs because each egg is gonna be one egg bite cheddar cheese, this is a Beecher's cheddar cheese from Seattle. You can use any cheese that you want. Bacon, I like to crisp my bacon up so that it keeps a little bit of its body as it's swimming in that liquid mixture. Green onions, I don't think that Starbucks puts green onions, but this is gonna enhance the flavor so much. Lastly, we've got some salt and pepper as well as butter. Now, make sure you set the temperature to 170 degrees, and that's gonna take about 10 or 20 minutes to heat up. I'm gonna go ahead and minced up these green onions so that it flavors all the uh, egg mixture. Um, I'm gonna crack the eggs into a Pyrex dish. I also at this point add the black pepper and mix. You don't really wanna whip this up because if you whip it up too much, it might be too fluffy and that, that dense flavor that makes it so delicious won't be there when you sous vide your egg bites. So I'm gonna go ahead and butter all these up then you're gonna take your egg mixture, slightly stir as you're pouring so that the green onions don't all go into a few of the egg bite dishes. And then after that, you're gonna take your cheese and bacon and individually place them evenly throughout all the mason jars. Woo! That looks so delicious. My sous vide egg bites are just about ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and sprinkle a little bit of salt on it cap it and then I'm gonna put it into the water and let it sit in there for about 50 minutes. So let's get that going. Google, set a timer for 50 minutes. Okay. All right, so the timer has gone off. It's been 50 minutes. I would suggest taking one out at this time and just checking it, but I can already tell they're all done. So I'm gonna take them out, and I did stop the sous vide machine. We'll pop it open and taste test. All right, so this is done cooking. You can either uh, put this in the fridge after it cools off or eat it right away. So the butter is gonna definitely help it not stick, but usually I just take a butter knife like that just all around the center. And then what I do is afterwards, slightly lift up the bottom with the edge of the butter knife. You just go like this. There you go. Are you guys the taste test? Oh, it's so tender. Oh my gosh, look at that. That cheese is dripping, like seriously. The best time to eat this is when it's just finished, but you can store this in the fridge, of course, but let's go ahead and taste it. Hopefully it's not too hot. Mmm, mm. that right there, mmm. Delicious sous vide egg bites right at home. What I love about these is you can pop it into the toaster, warm it up, or the microwave. I'm telling you, eating it fresh right away is also amazing. This has been another recipe here on my channel. My name is Benji Travis. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, which is Benjamin TV. Subscribe to this channel. Comment below what's your favorite flavor of egg bites when you go to Starbucks. If you guys wanna see all my recipe videos, click or tap the screen right here. If you guys wanna see my vlogs where I cook for my family, click or tap the screen right here. I love food. I know you love food too. Cook something delicious today.